What's up YouTube, welcome to another video here on tech improvement. Today we're going to cover the last of the three digital well-being experience released recently by Google on Android and this time we're looking at screen stopwatch. We've looked at envelope, we looked at activity bubbles and this one is a bit similar to activity bubbles I would say because it's a screensaver that shows how much time you already spent on your phone on that day. I'm running it right now, I created a new page because otherwise it will block it will be blocked out by all the apps it's on my home screen it's on my lock screen you just get the app called screen stopwatch and you should just be able to open it and set a wallpaper and home screen as you can see it's running up right now i just activated it so it doesn't show the time that has actually been spent on my phone already today it just starts a timer going up pretty much but it should work from like tomorrow properly <sighs> yes anyways it's it kind of reminds me of that big mac os wallpaper that you can install it's called like flipper or flicklo or anything just a big uh, analog clock put on your lock screen as a screensaver and I think it looks pretty cool I mean I understand how it works actually it's a bit surprising that they only came up with this right now it does look pretty cool but if I um, have apps on my <laughs> on my screen it's a bit hard to see and also if I have um, the time on my lock screen it's kinda like above that as well doesn't look amazing I would say I guess you could choose to not show the time or uh, do it in a different way I guess yeah but that's a downside I would say one advantage I see with this experiment over the activity bubbles is that it's kind of immediate so you're using your phone you see it going up uh, the counter going up every second quite crazy and uh, that really is more immediate than activity bubbles which kind of shapes you with a new bubble on your lock screen after a session if you don't know what I'm talking about exactly check out the other video on activity bubbles but this one yeah it kind of gives me anxiety while using my phone which is a good thing at least uh, judging it right now and it looks pretty cool serves its purpose um, I don't really ever know my screen time on top of my head if I don't go into settings, which I rarely do. And then I usually look at average around the week or find an excuse for why it probably has been high on Saturday because I was like traveling or something and didn't have anything else to do. But this one is quite immediate and I kind of like it as well. Um, I would say Activity Bubbles is more innovative. Innovative and this one is more practical I would say if you have your phone locked it doesn't move anymore the timer doesn't go up because you don't have it unlocked which is cool should work like that I kinda like I kinda get surprised that it does work like that <laughs> um, but yeah that's pretty much been it it's just a wallpaper home screen screensaver whatever Hope you enjoyed the video, check it out, I'll leave a link down below. Also like the minimal look, black and white to it. Uh, yeah, kind of makes sense with digital minimalism to have a minimal screensaver. Check it out, I'm gonna probably stick with activity bubbles, I think it just looks cooler. And um, that's been it for this video, check out the other videos I did on the digital well-being experiments here on this channel. If you liked it, leave a like on this video, subscribe for the other ones, and I'll see you all next time.